Hello, so what we're going to do in this video is use the sine ratio to solve for missing side length in a triangle. And we have a triangle here and we're asked to find the missing side length below. So we can see we've got this angle indicated here at 35 degrees, this side length at 15 centimeters, and this side is uh, left with a variable x for us to find. Our first step, as always, is to label the triangle. So we're going to label from the indicated angle across to the opposite side. And we know the longest side of the triangle, the one that is opposite the right angle, is always known as the hypotenuse. Next, we're going to pick the appropriate ratio. So remember, when working with trigonometry, we pick ratios using so ka toa. Because we have the opposite and the hypotenuse involved in our given or required information, we're going to use the sine ratio. So we go ahead and set up our ratio. We'll say sine, and we leave room for an angle, is equal to, and we'll create a fraction. This is going to be the ratio where we have our opposite over our hypotenuse. Now the angle is always your indicated angle, so sine of 35 degrees and we'll fill in the other blanks. In the numerator goes the first side length that you see. So for sine, it's the opposite. So in our case, that's x. And in the denominator goes the second one that you see. So in sine, it's the hypotenuse. And in our case, that's 15. So we're left with this ratio of sine of 35 degrees is equal to x over 15. Sorry, it's a proportion, not a ratio, because this ratio and this ratio are equal. Now we can evaluate sine of 15 using the calculator. So we just have to make sure that our calculator is in the correct mode. So in my case, it's in degrees. And we'll go ahead and use the sine button. So we'll type sine of 35. And we'll record that to four decimal places. So four decimal places is going to be 0.5736. So we'll replace sine of 35 with 0.5736. That's what our answer was to four decimal places here. Now this will be equal to x over 15. And just like solving one-step equations, our goal is to get x alone. So we've labeled, we've picked the ratio. Now we're going to solve. And to solve, we just multiply both sides by 15. In doing so, the 15s in the denominators cancel. We're left with just x on the right. And I'll take my answer, 0 0.5736, and multiply by 15 on my calculator. And I get 8.604. I'll keep that to a tenth. So 8. 0.6 centimeters is the missing side length. And that's how you use sine to solve for a missing side length.